Hi guys, so today's a lovely day, warm day. Sun's out. We're gonna go for a little hike or walk up to the Fortress Hill. And there's some nice houses on the way. So uh, follow us and uh, we'll check it out. It's only, what, a kilometer from our apartment. Uh, let's go see. Cute little street. Traditional houses from up around here. Yeah, they do look like uh, stuff in the UK. We have little cottages like this. But yeah, they're very small. So we're at the beginning of Chetatuya, the Fortress Hill. And there's the fortress up there. So, I think, not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure this place was built in the 1500s early and it was just a tower and four wooden bastidians, which were then destroyed in 1524 by some local Rares, I think, or Rares. Then it was rebuilt with walls and four towers. It's been attacked by Hungarians or defended by Hungarians, I think. I read that some Polish lieutenant or major shot himself at the doorway um, when the Russians came. And there's an 81 foot deep, no, 81 meter deep well inside that they dug. And it's also been used as a prison and most recently to keep documents for this area of Russia. And now it's just a, a tourist place which is permanently closed. I'm not sure because of COVID, but. Here we are at the entrance. Um, it was built in 1580. It says it on the door. There's an old window. So, as you can see, instead of actually spending money and replastering bits, they spend money on a sign that tells you that plaster's falling down. If you've got a spare hour and you're in Brashov, city centre, um, 
I suggest you come up here and have a walk. It's pretty easy. Walk around it, it is nice. It's a shame it's not well kept. Uh, hopefully it will reopen so you can go look inside one day. Have a look at that 81 meter deep well. Uh, it's got lovely views. There's Cucumber Mountain and all the mountain ranges over there. So it is worth the walk. It is nice. So now we walk around the, the fortress. We're going to go have a look what's in the woods down here. If we can get in there. These dark woods. I you don't see any pets today. Or maybe we're not. Maybe it's just a trap. <laughs> don't know what's down here, so we're going to go down, um, try and get out somewhere, and walk across this beautiful rug of uh, leaves and uh, try not to slip over. So after 15 minutes of walking through that woods, we're going to try to find our way home because we have no idea where we are. We just came out onto a street. So hopefully it's just a case of walking down the end of the street and turning right. It's nice being lost, uh, especially uh, these streets are kind of nice. I think we're coming up to a main road now though. 